Oh, I think he is getting a bit mad now. Oh, yes, he is. He's the Incredible Hulk. Let's see if this works. Oh, it does. It actually still works. He's trying to break free. Oh, um, is he okay? I'm back in People Playground using the Mutation Syringe once again. But the experiments are going to get even more crazy. I mean, look at this. We have a ghost. And we're going to use the ghost syringe to see what happens. But first, I got this comment right here. It says, Great vid. Thank you. Also, why didn't you use the jellyfish syringe? And then underneath that, I read the reply. It said, he must have made the vid before it came out, which is correct. I have not seen this syringe yet. The model's updated, so let's try it out. We're in the experiment hole right here. And for some reason, I've added the syringe to the top here by the rope. So let's go ahead and release it and see what happens. Apparently, it's pretty deadly. Oh, here we go. Okay. Is he turning into a jellyfish? Oh, man. Look at those limbs go. Whoa, that's super laggy. <laughs> that's insane. Whoa, that might be the craziest mutation in the mod. Oh, man, what is happening? How many arms does he have? Oh, he actually is a jellyfish. It actually works. Oh, the ropes have come loose. Hey, what's happening? Where are they going? Well, the tentacles. Oh, wait, are they going in for the ragdolls, the scientists? Um, you guys might want to press the big red button. I think the jellyfish might be after you. Oh, luckily there's glass. Oh, no. Oh, look out, buddy. Oh, he's got him. What? This mod's insane. Now where's it going? I was going for the other scientist. It's actually got him. It's pulling him in. No way. Now this guy's going to get messed up. Wait, what happened? <gasps> oh, no. Oh, I don't know what just happened there. But I don't think it was good for the scientists. All right, you know what? We're going to watch what happens with this guy right here, shall we? Oh, jeez. Okay, this might be the craziest mutation there is. Okay, don't worry. Barn's been pressed. We have to uh, get rid of this guy. That's it. Put him in the fire. Burn. <laughs> it's too dangerous. All right. This is why we put them in the experiment hole so we can go ahead and incinerate them. Okay, I think that should do the trick. We should probably move on to the next experiment. But yeah, that might be my new favorite one. So you can also probably tell the lab has been upgraded. So this used to be a gorse lab. And um, yeah, we've got quite a lot of experiments to try out here. But don't worry, if things go wrong, there is a self-destruct button. Right, starting off, we've got Minecraft Steve right here and a pig. I feel kind of bad for the pig, sorry. So this is the limb syringe. All right, Steve, here we go. Did it work? Oh, it did. Look at that. He's growing extra limbs. That is actually really cool. But the pig here, would it work on a pig? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, oh, it does. No way. We might have to try different syringes on different animals just to see what happens. Is that it? Is that all the limbs it grows? Well, I, uh, I, I guess so. Now, also in this lab, it actually has a taste. Oh, wait, look. The diamond play button, the thing that I'm trying to get. So make sure to like and subscribe to help me get that. Man, I really want one. Oh, I pressed open doors. Eh, it doesn't matter. Anyway, let's go ahead and taste them, shall we? Oh, did it work? Did I taste the pig and Steve? Oh, it did. Nice. Sorry, guys. They're probably getting really angry at me for doing that. Now, this one I am super excited for. Using the gas syringe on a Minecraft ghast. So... Of course, if you haven't seen what the syringe does, it basically turns any ragdoll into a ghast. But now we're using it on a ghast. Here we go. <gasps> oh, good thing I expanded this lab. Oh my. God. Okay. His head has just got massive. Um, Is that it? Oh, oh no. Okay. Well, I think we'll come back to this guy. The lab isn't actually big enough for him. Now I'm back in the original mutation lab because I quickly want to try the ghast syringe on a creeper. So here we go. And inject. Oh, oh, yes. That is epic. Now, because his head is bigger, does that mean the explosion power will be bigger? Let's test it out using this prisoner right here. Oh, is he okay? I think he passed out from the creeper. All right. Well, let's see what happens here, shall we? Oh, oh my goodness. I mean, the explosion was pretty powerful, but I don't think it was more powerful, though. Still pretty cool. And I think the prisoner's okay, too. Unless... I don't know what this one does. Or this one. Oh, whoops. Oh, no. Ah, yeah, this is bad. Ah. All right. We're just going to go ahead and leave this guy because we have another experiment to attend to. So this right here is Bruce Banner, also known as the Incredible Hulk. Now, I thought this would be a very fascinating experiment because he's technically already mutated, right? Well, the gamma radiation to some extent. Now, the only issue is I want to test it out. The cannibal syringe right here but while he's in his Hulk form. So we need to make him angry. And of course, as the facility has a built-in tase button, we're just gonna go ahead and tase him. Get angry. Maybe we'll tase him a few times. Yes, get angry. Oh, I think he is getting a bit mad now. Oh, yes, he is. 
He's the Incredible Hulk. Okay, quick. We need to inject him with a cannibal syringe. Let's see if this works. Oh, it does. It actually still works. That's so cool. Oh, he's been tased again. Uh, maybe we need to taste him some more. Yes. Okay, now he's mad. Oh, and because he's the Incredible Hulk, of course, he can just regenerate. So we have created a monster, a literal monster. He's angry, and I think he might want the blood of this scientist right here. Um, what are you, what are you doing? That, that's not how you get out. <laughs> he's trying to break free. Oh, um, is he okay? Yeah, he's fine. Yeah, and he's angry. Ugh, he's so angry. Oh no, we don't need to use the self-destruct, do we? Where's all the guards in this facility? Oh no. Scientist, are you okay? I think the Hulk's arm fell off. But it's fine because he can grow more, right? Yeah, actually, I wonder what happens if we use the uh, syringe again. Not much by the looks of things. Oh no, he is somehow escaping the facility. Okay, I think we've got no choice but to go ahead and press the self-destruct button. Here we go, self-destruct. I'm sorry, everyone, it has to be done. Oh my, okay, it had to be done, all right. We couldn't let the Incredible Hulk escape the facility. Wait a second. That never killed the Hulk. He's still alive. We just self-destructed for no reason. Oh, no. The facility. This is bad. And the ghast is escaping too. The double ghast. Looks like the Incredible Hulk is heading towards a small town right now. Everybody hide. Hey, buddy. You might want to get out of there. He's a cannibal now. Oh, no. Oh, it's too late. Hulk is going on a rampage. The syringe has made him even more angry. Okay, well, these houses just fell over right away. I don't know what these things are made out of, but I do know that the Incredible Hulk is now hungry for some ragdoll blood. Yeah, I think it's fair to say this town is absolutely ruined. Look at him go. Absolute savage madman. Right, we should probably do some more experiments, hopefully in a safer environment. Now, you might be wondering, why is there no roof to this place right here? Well, that's because this is a jellyfish syringe, and we're going to use it for some good. So this house right here is filled with prison escapees, and we're just going to go ahead and send in the jellyfish mutation thing to kill them all. All right, here we go. Let's see if it works. Also, um, scientist man, you might want to get out of there, buddy. I'm being deadly serious. You, you need to leave. Oh, no. Wait, is it already working? Because, yeah, it's happening. Look at that. He's going right towards the prison inmates. Yes. We're not even going to send them back to prison. They are just going to be eaten by a jellyfish, I guess. Oh, look, the scientist survived. He's so lucky. Oh, here we go. Um, Oh, no. They're shooting. They're shooting the jellyfish. Oh, he's got him. He's got him. No, it's too late. Yeah, they're so screwed. <laughs> is anyone else going to try and shoot? That's the only guy with a gun. I mean, there's... Plenty of weapons in here. Oh, he's gone. That's it. Has that guy been grabbed? I think he has. It doesn't look like he's been grabbed fully, but he's floating. Oh my goodness, he's gone. Yeah, he definitely got grabbed. Now, of course, the jellyfish mutation right here, because it makes the limbs super long and like jellyfish stingers, it means that the arms can just go ahead and sneak in to the house and probably pick up the rest of the prisoners. Oh, here we go. Oh, he's got him. He's got him all right. Wait, why is he burning? I think the light bulbs might be a little bit too hot. Oh, he's actually got him. Look at that. Look at him go. That is so creepy. Oh, that is insane. Right, looks like there's one prisoner left. He has no idea what is going on right now. Can the arm even get to him? Oh my goodness, the arm just came off, but somehow has still grabbed him. What is going on? Is it still going to work? I think it might. I'm pretty sure. Oh, yep, there it is. Jellyfish can also regenerate, right? What's happening with the gut? Uh, okay. <laughs> Look how long that stinger is. Oh, no. Um, scientist, man. Uh, looks like you're next, buddy. I, I don't know why you didn't run before. Oh, no. Scientist. Get out of there, man. Oh, it's got him. It's got him, all right. Oh, he doesn't stand a chance now. See, once you've been taken by the jellyfish, <laughs> there's no going back. But now let's try and combine some of the syringes. So um, I think this is the tree syringe. Does it work alongside the jellyfish one? Let's find out. Come on. It, it doesn't. Oh, it does work. Look at that. He's also becoming a tree. That is insane. And you know what? Why stop there? Let's go ahead and use the gas syringe. Hit. Eh, inject. Oh, I got it. Oh, look at that. <laughs> So because the tree mutation makes heads, I think what it ends up doing is enlarging them all. Okay, I, I think I might be breaking people playground once again. All right, new experiments. Now look who's returned. It's the Incredible Hulk, no longer in its cannibal form. But I thought it'd be interesting to turn him into a serpent, basically a snake. Right, here we go. Inject. 
Let's see if it works. Also, I really don't know why scientists are in this room because they just usually end up getting messed up. Okay, well, it's working. So let's remove the syringe. Oh my goodness, look at that. So Hulk is now becoming a snake. Oh, that's happening really fast. Okay, this room is not big enough for this. Look out, scientists. <laughs> okay, that is insane. Um, well, while that's happening, in the next room, we've also got Spider-Man, which I kind of feel like also turning into a snake. So here we go. Let's see what happens here, shall we? Honestly, I'm surprised we haven't really used a snake syringe that much in this video because it is such a great one. Oh, no, look at that. Oh, he's still using his webs. Even when he's becoming a snake, he can't really web onto anything, though. So I guess he still has his powers then. <laughs> Oh, these rooms look absolutely crazy right now. And I'm pretty sure the Hulk can still regenerate as well. Let's have a look. Yep, a snake that will never die. Um, Spidey snake, don't be... No, don't web the scientist. Don't do it. Oh, okay, uh, I think Spider-Man's angry that this has happened to him. I think the mutations do make uh, these ragdolls pretty angry. So we didn't have much space before with the gas. So I'm going to go ahead and try again. So... Gas syringe with the gas. Here we go. Oh, look at that. And there's also a guy right here. Oh, wait. One of its things just came off. Oh, no. So this is the spore syringe. So it should make multiple, I think. Let's see if it works. Oh, my. Yeah, so anything it touches, like any humans or ragdolls, um, it infects them as well. So he's now also become the spore mutation. But it's interesting that the gas just remains to be one giant head. This should be a very interesting experiment right here. Because we've got SCP-096. Now, as we all know, SCP-096 has really long limbs, which is why I'm going to give him the long limb switch. So, <laughs> yeah, here we go. Oh, okay. That's terrifying. Ah, uh, make it stop. <laughs> oh, no. He's just a, a ball of limbs. I was not expecting that outcome. Oh, that's so weird. What is happening? Oh, he's unraveling. <laughs> he's unraveling. I can't believe he's even longer than what he was before. Uh, maybe send in the guards and neutralize the threat. Go, go, go. Move in, move in. Take it down, take it down. Fire. That's it. Kill SCP-096. Oh, wait, that's right. You can't really kill him. Oh, no. Get out of there, man. Get out. Don't look at his face. Oh, it's probably a bit late for that, isn't it? Yep. Well, he's going to go on a rampage now. Great. Make sure to like and subscribe.